Hello, hello, rock stars. Oh, I just noticed a typo. We're going to fix it right here while we are live together. You ready? 2021, August. What is it? 28? <laughs> oh, welcome to a very real life, very fun, very excited and happy to have you. Free Motion Quilting Academy graduation. My name is Holly Ann Knight of String and Story, and I am beyond delighted to get to present the graduating class of summer 2021 for Free Motion Quilting Academy to y'all tonight. We are live on Facebook and we are live on Insta not Instagram, Facebook and uh, <laughs> YouTube. <sighs> It's going to be a fabulous evening. All right, let me get my swipe left to reveal comments and reactions. All right, I'm trying to get this to where I can see y'all as well as here we are. Hello, Cindy. Hey, Teresa and others. I am absolutely delighted to have you. If you are here with me, do say hello in those comments so that I can see you. I'm going to give everyone a few minutes to join us. I know that we have almost a hundred graduates joining us this evening, um, and we want to give them as much time as possible to log on and join. Um, I also have here with me tonight, Heather, she is going to be just keeping an eye on the chat and making sure that all of y'all's questions get answered. Hello, Sarah Little, Selwyn, Kate, Joanne, I see some of y'all over on YouTube as well. Huzzah! Wherever you are watching, while we are giving everyone a moment to join us, will you kindly like or follow, uh, whether that's subscribing to my YouTube channel or liking my Facebook page, I would really appreciate that. That'll make it easier for us to stay in touch in the future. All right. Suzanne, don't worry if you can't find the Facebook version, um, but it is there. You know what I'm going to do? I'm actually glad you mentioned that, Suzanne. I'm going to make sure that it gets pinned to the top of our string and story page. Dun, 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 dun. Well, if the page loads, that would be a good thing. Heather, can you pin that for me? It does not seem to want to cooperate on my end for reasons that are escaping me at the moment. <laughs> Hello, Deborah, Janet, uh, Lisa, Deb, and others. I am absolutely delighted that you're here. All right, we are at 8.02. So without further ado, if you are here live and you are graduating this evening, when I get to your slide, feel free to jump into the chat um, and just tell us a word or two about your uh, final projects. Um, if you're here in the replay, do the same there as well. All right, let's get started. Tonight is our Free Motion Quilting Academy graduation. And as I mentioned, my name is Holly Ann Knight of String and Story, and it is my absolute delight to guide you to quilt with confidence. Tonight, we are celebrating 95 or so rock stars who have completed the Free Motion Quilting Academy, um, and they have done so by completing two major projects. They have completed their sampler, showing all the motifs that they have learned. And they've also completed their whole cloth project, which is a quilt of their own design. Uh, and everything on it is thread, right? So they have designed and stitched this out on a uh, plain piece of fabric. And y'all, the projects, as always, are absolutely phenomenal. So let's jump right in. Let's start by talking about the qualities of a quilting rock star as I continue to have technical difficulties with my images here. Because each of those who are graduating tonight have demonstrated some really amazing traits. First, they have demonstrated the willingness to do the work to make progress on their quilting skills. This really is no small feat, right? To set the time aside, um, to learn a new skill, to face the fear of learning a new skill, and to persevere to the very end. They have demonstrated dedication to giving themselves grace when the practice is messy. Some of the folks who are graduating tonight have been working on this skill with me inside the Free Motion Quilting Academy for a year or more. That is incredible persistence. They have um, demonstrated the joy in celebrating accomplishments and finished projects, and not only celebrating their own accomplishments and finished projects, but also those of the folks around them. They have had a commitment to encouraging others 
on their journeys and watching this group celebrate one another and be celebrated by the other members of the academy has been nothing short of amazing. Finally, uh, number five, they have demonstrated a delight in quilting community and camaraderie. And I think that is really important all the time, but especially over the last year and a half as we have been navigating the COVID-19 pandemic. And there are so uh, many reasons and ways in which to feel and act separate from one another. Uh, and instead, these rock stars have come together to really build community and camaraderie. And that is absolutely incredible. So allow me to jump us right in. First up is Allison Willie. You will notice on each of these slides that you're gonna see a sampler quilt. That's the grid like quilt like this, showing each of the motifs learned in Free Motion Quilting Academy, and then an amazing whole cloth by each student that they designed and executed themselves. Amber Richter. These are incredible, you guys. Amy Olson. I really appreciate uh, Amy's anti-COVID sentiment on here. <laughs> She's grinning behind that. Amy Welt. We are a few themes each year, and nature is always a strong theme. It has our meaningful words, which I love. Andrea Millers. Love your bright colors. And Richardson. Y'all, I love this opportunity to see each of your faces as well. Barbara Barnett. We had a few panels make their appearance this year. Uh, the opportunity to make use of something that's already been printed and add to it. And I love Barbara's example. Becky Heron. Love the whale hiding in there as well as your bright sampler. Binti Antonsen. Betty Ann Thibodeau. Another strong nature theme, love that. Bonnie Care. Bonnie Knight. Oh, I just noticed that your says family here, Bonnie. I hadn't noticed that the first time I looked at it. Brenda and Drusen. Brenda, I don't know what happened to your image, my dear. Oh no. I have it at the end as well, so hopefully we'll see it there. Let's see if I escape out. Hopefully it'll load for us. I want us to be able to see yours. Also forgive me if I completely butchered your last name. All right, Brenda, let's try again. Bonnie, Bonnie, Brenda. All right, y'all can see it a little bit there. Let's see if it'll load. Can I zoom? Ha ha, a workaround so we can see your hummingbirds. There it goes. Carol Downey. Carolyn Bullock. Carolyn, are you still dressed up for us tonight? Carolyn posted a fabulous picture of her all done up for the evening. Catherine Harvey. Love your sea turtle. Oh, so many wonderful projects, you guys. Catherine Jones. This is Yosemite, correct, Catherine? Hopefully I got that right. I'm always terribly afraid of not getting it correct. Kathy Maxwell, truly a rock star. Cindy Nichter, your smile, Cindy. It says everything. Claire Krieger, love your red, white, and blue and your beautiful flag. Connie Charters. Cynthia Croms. I just noticed this. Uh, significance here, Cynthia. Brilliant. Deborah Carlisle. DJ Cochran. Good enough to eat, DJ. Donna Wagner. Wagger. Wager. Oh, I'm sorry. I should have asked. Your your cat is so magnificent, by the way, Donna. We had a whole conversation about how much we love your cat. <laughs> Eileen McMillan, the smiles, y'all. Elizabeth McRae. Ellen Carley. I'm trying to say less this time, you guys, because I'm proud of each and every one of you and your work is so beautiful. Emily Lee. And I want y'all to just 
bask in these, just bask in these. I can chat too much and I want you to just enjoy. Emily Atencio. I like how you snuck these little prints in here, Emily. Fran Porsche. The purple, great call. Gail Stafford. Your smile, Gail. Oh, some of you all met recently, so and that's wonderful. Jamie Breen. I like your color theme. I love a color theme. Janet Scott. Janet Sims. Y'all, some of y'all sent in some really fabulous front and back photos this time. We there's always some, but I feel like I feel like y'all were really intentional about your front and back photos for us this time around. Janet Wimmer. These bright, happy samplers always. Jana Mayo. Mao Mayo. I'm sorry, I should have asked for notes. Love your choice of variegated thread here. That looks so good. Jeannie Carter. Joan Cruz. Joanne Swanson. Joey Goodman. I, okay, y'all, don't miss this though. I know I said I was trying to let you bask, but don't miss that Joey put her sampler on her whole cloth. And I just think that's so great. <laughs> Joanne Karen. I love seeing how y'all come up with ways to use these designs. Jory Ellis. So for those of you who are watching who are not familiar with the instructions of this whole cloth, especially, Josephine Wayne, I tell the rock stars, I say, I want you to show off. I want you to make it your own design. Judy Hawthorne, and I want you to make it maybe a little bit autobiographical, right? And I know that not every single one of these pieces is necessarily autobiographical. Judy Sh Shibanoff. Y'all have done some fun things with shapes too. But I know that not necessarily every single one of these pieces is actually autobiographical, but I love how sometimes they really are. And it's so fabulous. Julianne Neff. Your three kitties. Ah, we're big cat people around here. Y'all know that. Um, I love getting this little glimpse into what is meaningful to you. Right? That's what's so special about this is we get to not only see your faces, uh, but get a little glimpse into what you love. Karen Lee Ledbetter. Love this. Karen McDonald. I also love how many ocean lovers are in my rock stars. It's like y'all know what I love. I'm glad that we agree on our love of the ocean. Karen McKinney. Ooh, today. That is good. I'm an Enneagram three. Being in the moment is hard. That's a beautiful reminder. Karen Sykes. I hope each and every one of you is going to hang this up as a reminder of what an incredible rock star you are. Kate Brennan featuring Jack, I think, as quilt holder. Is that correct, Kate? Yes. Jamie says her whole cloth is the kelp forest in the Monterey Bay where she scuba dives. I love that. Y'all remember if you're here with me live, drop a sentence or two in the chat um, telling us about your project. I'm going to try to get, can I get this pulled back up? There it is. I want to be able to see my, my chat on Facebook as well. Oh, it is not letting me see them. Let's see. Kathleen Rose. Kay Curl. These are so good. I see, I see on uh, Facebook that one of y'all commented that one of you knocked it out of the park and I that all of y'all have knocked out of the park. And I love that. And I agree completely. Kayla Rogers. 
the use of shapes still y'all love it. Christy Marbutt. Y'all notice how some of these whole cloths feel very traditional and some of them feel very modern. I love that. I love the individuality of these. Laura Martin, the breadth of subject matter, of color, of the motifs chosen. Linda Barhill. We had a strong representation of dragonflies this year, y'all. That's another thing that the rock stars clearly love. Oh, thank you, Heather, for pinning the video at the top of the page. Yes. Linda Block. Love, love, love. Linda, I do want to know if you're here with us live, are you or your spouse a pilot? Love of flying, would love to know the backstory. Linda Jackson. All right, I do have to share this. Linda sent us an email with her project that her grandson drew this picture um, a while back and she commented that it would make a fabulous quilt. And so for her whole cloth, she recreated his illustration, which I just think is fabulous. Linda Tucker, more dragonflies and bright colors. Oh yes, Emily is uh, reassuring me that her nerdy Star Wars whole cloth is hanging in her office. Lisa Alter, Lisa mad props on the high contrast thread choice. Love, love, love. Lisa Barlow. Lori May Maynard. I'm practicing my segmentation, y'all. Also notice too, so the directions on the sampler, y'all, everyone was told for their whole cloth to show off, to be creative, to maybe share a little something about themselves via their whole cloth, right? Um, the directions for the sampler were to have nine or 10 inch squares sewn together and to put one motif per square. But what I love is how we have 95 rock stars tonight, Lori Pace who were given the same set of directions, right? But with a lot of room for creative freedom, right? Because y'all are whole adults and I want these to be yours even as I give you some guidelines, right? Margaret Farganoli. And what I love is that even with these quilts that were given the same sets of directions, we have so much variety from rock star to rock star. Martina Jones. We've got a few different sizes. As far as um, size, the whole cloth was has to be at least fat quarter size. I love that we've got a few exceptions this year of slightly different sized whole cloths. Mary Ritchie, different arrangements of colors and fabrics, different choices of how many thread colors to use. Mary Wolf. A few really fabulous creative licenses in terms of the interpretation of a nine or 10 inch square that worked out brilliantly, if I do say so myself. Megan Campbell. I'm really digging this color scheme, Megan. These are beautiful. Michelle Keller. A little bit of thread painting making an appearance this year. Love it, love it, love it. Nancy Fisher. Nancy, is that is that already its permanent place or is that on your design wall? I really hope this has a permanent place somewhere. Love this gingham. Look at the use of transparency here, y'all. Nancy's like, I'm making a quilt I'm going to enjoy on my couch. Nancy Moses. Love the starry night. That looks so good. Nancy Stowe. Happy, happy, happy. Natasha Wild, your grin, rock star, everything. And action cures fear, one of our favorite phrases inside of Free Motion Quilting Academy, uh, coined by Angelia Trinidad, founder of Passion Planner, and truly an inspirational phrase if I've ever heard one. Patty Young. Oh, it's Old Faithful, yay! Rebecca Toss. I hope y'all are noticing the different ways that the same motifs like ribbon candy or McTavishing or pebbles um, can be so different 
depending on the whole cloth and depending on how they're being used. Sabine Schweiger. Love the way you staggered your wishbones here. So good. Sarah Little. So notice these, we've got some of the same shapes here. It's just a couple uh, whole cloths back and just different effects. Same motif, different effects. Sherry Jones. I'm really delighted to see the um, embellished continuous curves making some appearances this year. Those are not always a favorite. I like it. Sharon Tinder. Classic red and white. Love it so much. Shelly Allen. Even here, right? Remember, same set of directions on a whole cloth. Um, same subject matter in some ways with hot air balloons. And yet we have two really gorgeous, different hot air balloon quilts tonight. Shirley Subtle. Seek her. More kitties. Y'all know the way to our hearts. <laughs> Susan Shooter. Susan Waldvogel. Susan, we were wondering, did you write or embroider? If you look closely at Susan's whole cloth, it says, nothing in this world is perfect, so just deal with it. <laughs> Susan Wright. Your smiles, y'all. Your smiles, you get me. Get me every time with your smiles. Susie Shepherdson. Suzanne Kerrig. Let me toggle over to my folks on YouTube. Suzanne Lilly. This is just so great, y'all. So good. See these little autobiographical notes, right? Tammy Gadbury. More thread painting. Love it. Therese Labugan. Therese, I practiced all afternoon, I promise. Labugan. Did I get it right? You're beautiful, San Francisco. All right, and I got to switch to my other slide deck, y'all. There were too many of you to put in one slide deck. How cool is that? Valerie Murray. Vicki Palmore Hale. Wynn McNeil. And y'all, it is now time, as Heather makes her way downstairs, to officially pop the champagne. Rockstars, your work, as always, is absolutely magnificent. We are so thankful for each and every one of you. We are thankful for the opportunity to celebrate you tonight. We are thankful to get to share your gorgeous work with your fellow classmates, fellow students, and perhaps future classmates as well. So, Heather, shall we? I had to get Heather to help because those of you who are graduating tonight, you know that Heather joined right as y'all were enrolling. Here, let me put these down. So we don't... Oh, no, I'm real scared. <laughs> Please know we get terrified at this part every single time. But uh, Heather is joining me. She's hiding off the camera. All right, ready? This is definitely going to like pop. Oh my God. I think you just shove it if you read the directions on the lid. <laughs> Stars with the very unofficial and yet very exciting vested in me by me, I declare you free motion quilting rock stars. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, my delightful humans. <laughs> Come here, Anna. You gotta, you gotta get where we can see you. This is all bubbles. <laughs> oh man, it's in my hair. Isn't it? We're gonna be cleaning that up for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> so rock stars oh dear we lost the feed here so i can't even see us rock stars cheers to you congratulations we are so thankful for you
So that went right on my nose. <laughs> My darling rock stars, please drop in the comments for me as I'm, woo, hold on. We got to do that again. That was really exciting. Ready? Ready? <laughs> All right. We need a little bonus celebration there. Drop in the comments for me how you are celebrating this evening because you deserve truly all the champagne. Thanks, Heather. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all know that Heather came as we were enrolling on. It felt only fit that she get to celebrate right along with us. If you are here with me tonight and you're going, oh my gosh, this is ridiculous and crazy and so much fun. How do I learn how to be a free motion quilting rock star? I want to share with you the words of some of tonight's graduates. And then I will tell you how you can become a free motion quilting rock star as well. All right. I would love to invite you to join me inside the Free Motion Quilting Academy. That is the program that all of these amazing rock stars just graduated from. And we are right now enrolling our next cohort of students. And these 95 students and another like 1,700 are waiting with open arms to be part of your journey so that we can pop the champagne and pop the confetti and celebrate you achieving your free motion quilting dreams as well. I love this. I love how y'all are dropping all your celebrations in. Yes, yes, yes. So here's what you need to know. Bensie, oh no, the technology. Let's hit refresh. We got this. At this point, y'all, we're just, we're enjoying our celebration champagne, right? That's how we're doing this. I wanted to share with you the words of a few of tonight's rock stars, um, because I feel like ultimately these rock stars encapsulate Free Motion Quilting Academy better than I ever could. In many ways, they are Free Motion Quilting Academy. So Allow me to read their words. Benzie shares, I love the academy and the course gave me so many skills and tools to become a confident quilter. I had done meanders before, but wanted to learn more free motion motifs. Now I have a great toolbox, which I can use on everything. And the extra bonus was how to make quilting plans. I'm so very happy and grateful with what I have learned. Working at my own pace and on my own time has been very much needed in order to complete the sampler and the whole cloth. Thank you, Holly Ann. Benzie, if you are here, how many um, cohorts did it take for you to graduate out of curiosity? This is something I try to ask uh, periodically. Therese, as a newbie quilter with lots of new piece tops, I didn't even realize that many quilters sent their quilts out to be finished. So I bought a Juki TL 2010Q and decided to learn how to quilt my own quilts. This course gave me the tools and confidence to feel comfortable in completing a quilt from start to finish. I found the Facebook group to be super beneficial and staying connected and accountable. So much more fun to learn with peers and cheer each other along our FMQ journey. I also appreciate how the two final projects were so different. Presenting various motifs on a large quilt and then stretching our imaginations and creativity with the whole cloth were worth a worthwhile and valuable experience. And y'all just got to experience the fruit of these rock stars creativity. Woo! Now I have two quilts to truly treasure. Thank you so much, Holly Ann. This is a fantastic course that I would highly recommend to any quilter interested in becoming better at free motion quilting. Brenda says, this was an outstanding course. I had my doubts about feathers, but with Holly Ann's guidance and encouragement from the Facebook group, I was able to stick with it and finish. I'm so thrilled to be able to finish my own quilts with confidence now. The main reason I enrolled for this course was the accessibility and the no pressure to finish with this cohort policy. That's true. Inside Free Motion Quilting Academy, once you join, you have lifetime access so you can work at your own pace. As a former jazz and size instructor, I love that you stress the importance of good posture, taking stretch breaks and hydrating. Sitting for too long can wreak havoc with the body. I still exercise daily with online programs, including jazzercise, hiking or walks in the neighborhood. I wasn't able to do any of the live Q and A's, but I learned a lot from watching the replays. A friend of mine enrolled in the next cohort based on my rave reviews and the ability to take her time. So excited to get to know your friend, Brenda. Thank you, Holly Ann, for sharing your talent and wisdom with us. So y'all, if you're curious about Free Motion Quilting Academy and you want to jump in, it is a proven method to take you from being a nervous beginner quilter to a confident intermediate free motion quilting rock stars like all of these fabulous folks that you got to meet tonight. And I love sharing about the Academy when we have graduation because there's really just no better time than to say, Look at these awesome humans. Let's celebrate them. And then let's celebrate your dream too. So Free Motion Quilting Academy includes a whole lot of stuff. Six professionally recorded video units teaching you all the ins and outs of free motion quilting from setup to how to stitch over two dozen motifs. Each of those six units has five to seven videos. Each of those videos is five to seven minutes long, give or take. Um, so we keep it short enough that you can watch and rewatch with ease as you are learning, but long enough that they are all a great deep dive 
video uh, series. Um, there's also a bonus unit about how to make quilting plans, a newly updated 50 plus page course workbook and access to an exclusive Facebook group for 12 weeks of live video Q and A's as, as well as ongoing support from me and your fellow rock stars, including the fabulous folks who are graduating tonight. And you get lifetime access to all of the above. This is the part that several of the rock stars were refer referring to in their words was about how this is a 12 week course, but if you don't finish in 12 weeks, you get to just keep going. You stay in the course, you continue to learn and grow. You continue to turn tune into Q and A's with the following cohorts and you don't have to pay any extra to do that, all right? So for about the cost of sending one or two quilts out to the long armor, it is time for your free motion quilting dreams to come true. If you're like, yes, ma'am, I'm in, you can head to stringandstory.com forward slash yes to join all of these amazing rock stars. Our class will officially begin on September 13th. A few quick advantages of the Free Motion Quilting Academy is that it allows you to learn free motion quilting from the privacy and comfort of your own home on your machine, on your time, in your time zone, when it works for you, even if you're on the other side of the world from me, right? This is the gorgeousness of technology. It encourages you to start with what you have, keeping supplies minimal and affordable, rather than urging you to buy the big fancy machine and all the gadgets. I really just want to get you started. Facing that fear that sometimes pops up. I put fear in quotation marks because I want to banish it so fast. I don't want to even like give it full power, right? But some of that anxiety that we feel, I want to banish that and show you that you are a very, very capable human. Free Motion Quilting Academy is ready when you are, regardless of geography or time zone, with on-demand pre-recorded video lessons. And I think this has become more valuable and special than ever with the pandemic. Free Motion Quilting Academy offers you ongoing access to yours truly. <laughs> so we can do ridiculous things like pop champagne and confetti and all of the things together. Um, but the real reason that I want you to have access to me is because I never want you to feel alone or stuck on your Free Motion Quilting journey. I want you to know that I've got your back and that's why we do the live Q and A's each week so that as you learn and as you grow, when you bump up against something you're like, I tried the thing you told me and it didn't work, now what? I can answer those questions for you. The Q and A's are on Thursdays at 11 a.m. Eastern, but there is always a replay because I know that time doesn't work for everyone. And you always have the opportunity to ask questions ahead of time so I can answer live, even if you can't be with me live. The Free Motion Quilting Academy also connects you to other rock stars in training and rock star graduates like these folks around the world so that you can help and encourage each other. So one last little story I wanted to share. This is from Kayla, who also graduated tonight. She said, free motion quilting was always something that just seemed way too scary for me to even try. That may sound familiar to some of you. The fast needle movement, having to be able to freehand a design and not being perfect like a computer were all major discouragements. I followed Holly Ann for the last little bit, just trying to justify the cost of the course to myself and getting up the courage to try for motion quilting. And after hearing that you'd had a professional team come in and shoot this latest set of videos and convincing myself to do scary things, I signed up. Yes, ma'am, we can do hard things. This whole course was professionally done and really well put together. Besides the sampler, I have free motion quilted four other quilts with four different all over designs. Leapy Meander, Square Spirals, Wood Grain, and Paisley Swirls. Yes, 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 yes. That is exactly what I wanted to be able to do after this course. Money so well spent. Kayla, you like saved your investment just by doing those four quilts. So cool. Um, thank you to Holly and the team for adding so much energy to this process and having an infectious excitement to learn it all. I will recommend this course to anyone who wants to learn free motion quilting. I now have the free motion quilting bug and can't wait to try other designs on my own. So Rockstars, if you are here and you are not part of the Free Motion Quilting Academy or part of this graduating class, I would love for you to start your journey with me. It would be my honor and delight to spend the rest of 2021 with you, sharing my knowledge about free motion quilting and helping your free motion quilting dreams come true so that in December, we can pop the champagne to you. If that sounds super exciting, you can go to stringandstory.com forward slash yes. Huzzah! Rockstars, I am so proud of and for each of you. And I am just so delighted that we get to be here. This is fabulous. Thank you. Thank you so much. Linda, Linda has said it perfectly. Linda says, congratulations, everyone. I am so proud of us all. You each did such beautiful work. Thank you for the hard work that you put in. I know that these final projects are not easy, but you did the hard 
thing and your work has paid off. I'm so, so proud of each and every one of you. Thank you for selecting me to be your teacher. Thank you for putting in the work to finish this course. Thank you for coming and celebrating tonight. And now rock stars, I just want to remind you, we'll be sending out your graduation pins. It will probably take a week or so. So be patient with us as we get those labels printed up and get them sent out. But we will be sending out our very special congratulations in the mail to you. Cheers to each of you. Have an absolutely fabulous evening and enjoy that well-earned title of Free Motion Quilting Rockstar.